What's up, YouTubers? This is Dr. Sharif, and in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to jailbreak just about any iDevice running iOS 8, 8.0.1, or 8.1 via Pangu tool. You need um, to back up your iDevice to iTunes before doing anything. And I'm just gonna go ahead into settings and then general about. And uh, I'm gonna show you guys that I'm running already version 8.1 right here, as you can see. Um, what you need to download is like a Pango jailbreak tool, WinSCP for Windows, and a couple of CDA uh, files. The links are gonna be down below in the description. The first step um, is actually deactivating the uh, the find my iPhone, you might want to navigate to iCloud and then deactivate your um, find my iPhone, deactivate also your passcode. Uh, right click on the Pango jailbreak tool and run as administrator. Click yes and then it um, a little window pops up right in front of you and it says it recognizes your iPhone, iPhone Sharif, iPhone 6. Um, might want to uncheck this box first and then click the blue button uh, right here and then uh, a little bar uh, popped up in the screen right now Like it finished on the window here and the iPhone is rebooting one more time. So again, there it's only a few steps and then you uh, you will be ready to go. So as you can see here, let's go. And then <clears throat> you have a new icon here. It says Pangu on your screen. <clears throat> if you open that, you're gonna find OpenSSH here. You're gonna click install on that. Click this button and click install at the top right hand corner right here. It says downloading down there. And then when it's finished, then you need to click OK. And then what you um, want, want to check this out, like click re, uh, reload here, open SSH one more time and it says reinstall. That means it's already successfully installed. What you need to do right now is uh, right click on the Win, uh, Windows uh, SCP, right click on that, open as, run as administrator, hit OK, hit yes. And then what you need to do is navigate to your settings and then click on Wi-Fi. Then... So username is by default for Apple is root, uh, lowercase r-o-o-t, password is by default lowercase alpine, a-l-p-i-n. E, and then uh, stay on port number 22 and click log in and it's connecting to the host um, the iPhone and the the computer or laptop should be connected to the same network click yes 
and it's right there so um, uh, you need to uh, look at your desktop on the left side in here and look at the root side in here to simply do that like open this and click root uh, what you need to do actually is uh, simply grab these two CDF files we uh, we copied on your desktop here simply drag them and uh, from the left side here uh, to uh, the right side uh, first of all the number 1.1.12 uh, uh, right here <clears throat> there you go this is the first one click OK and then followed by the 1.1.13 and then there you go after doing that you need to uh, click Control T on your keyboard uh, in Windows uh, it opens up the command center uh, and then you might want to take those two comma commands uh, the, the they're gonna be also in the description so I'm gonna uh, copy them and uh, paste them in here and click execute could give you an error uh, that's okay and then you want to take the second one here The complete line and you copy that paste it in here click execute and it says errors were encountered while uh, processing Cydia but that's okay I'm gonna go ahead and uh, click close I'm gonna go ahead and uh, you know, shut down my iPhone, reboot it actually. So the iPhone uh, just booted up already and uh, let me check check out of the uh, if actual and boom gentlemen we got Cydia running on iOS 8 and it says perfect preparing file system is doing complete so the Cydia has finished preparing the file system for the first time and uh, the device has rebooted I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put in my password and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, launch Cydia one more time uh, let's go gentlemen it says welcome to Cydia and a big red message right here almost nothing works on iOS yet please be patient while people work on many kinds of updates and fixes there is you guys it says down there iPhone 7.2 uh, iOS 8.1 Cydia 1.1.13 and this is it you guys if you like this video hit the thumbs up uh, if you want to see more of my videos uh, click on that subscribe button uh, thank you guys for watching and i'm gonna see you guys in the next video peace